Uh, many of your own guardians, your guides, your teachers, your friends, uh, have this commonality in that their job is twice as difficult because you're not following through with those things you've heard to do, well, countless times in some cases, but at least several times in most. Think of it. Have you not got a prompting to do this, to do this, to do this? Not once, not twice, perhaps three, perhaps more times. Have you done it? Not. Not yet. Well, then, uh, why are you making us work so hard? Is what we want to know. <laughs> That's it. Won't you make it just a bit more pleasant for all of us? And I say for all of us because the moment that you do follow through, you'll find, of course, that you end up in a better place, wondering why it took you so long to get there. And then, of course, we can all get on to the next thing, you see. Isn't it lovely? When everyone does what they're told. <laughs> it's just that your own resistances, my dears, we understand quite clearly, are to each other, are to mortals, are to people who have given you their foolish guidance, and at the time, perhaps, you were not too discerning, you followed it and found yourself uh, far away from home. So we understand, but um, we would also like you to take a bit of time and consider the source from whence came that faulty information. And if you can bear it, perhaps give us the benefit of the doubt. So, dear ones, please do follow through, won't you? When you feel that thing, that prompting, that inner drawing towards something or away from something. If you'll stop to note for just a moment, you might note that it's not quite coming quite from you. It's not your intrinsic feeling in many cases. Not that you're against it perhaps, but it's uh, not something that you're, uh, you know, a very familiar thing with. You're not really quite at one with that thing. So that's why it's got to be suggested, one way or the other, towards or against. So then, that being the case, we would ask you to give it a bit of thought, won't you? Work with us and we'll work with you. There'll be some of you here who've complained that you're not able to hear or see or sense uh, the realms of spirit, nor we who inhabit them very much. You, you find a frustration in such. You feel a bit of a, almost like a, a, a rancor or something. You're not liking it. You complain to the medium. I can't see clearly. I can't see at all. I can't hear. When will I? How can I? What may I do? And to this we would say, well, why don't you work with what you've got? But there is something there already, and if you would start with that, you could get more. It's that we can't give three directives if you not follow through on the first. <laughs> That's really what it comes down to, dear ones. So, as you will it, as you will it.